Hello everyone, my name is Piano Guy. Welcome back to Banjo Tooie. In the last episode, we started uh, pretty much working our way up to uh, collecting most of everything in uh, Terry Dacty Land. But uh, in this episode, we'll be uh, finishing Terry Dacty Land. Hopefully, and without any minor interruptions. Besides my cameraman. <laughs> Alright. So, what I'm gonna do first, I'm gonna go over to Mumbo. Make sure I don't fall into all that goopiness, whatever that stuff is. Alright, let's head back in here. And let's actually utilize this. You want Mumbo's help again? Yes, I do. All right, let's head over to Wombo's Woodwan. This works. Enlarge. Wombus would want. Alright, there we go. And also, I'm gonna show you some dialogue of what happens when you enter Wumbo's Woodwan as Wumbo. Mumbo, not welcome. Leave now or be in big heap trouble. So, yeah, we're not allowed to be in here. Actually, sir. Mumbo, get out of pool. Yeah, nothing happened. We don't get the transformation as Mumble, unfortunately. <laughs> Although that would be hilarious. <laughs> if that was the case, but nope. That's not the case at all. Alright, let's head back in here. Mumble back in his chair. Oh. Alright, and then let's head back over to Wumba's Wigwam to uh, get a uh, much bigger transformation. And boom. Wee. Wumba called this Daddy T Rex. His control stick to move and B to make much noise. So now we're a giant now we're a giant Tyrannosaurus Rex. And we're pretty much immortal. We can we can't die. We can't Get, we can't deal, we uh, don't get hurt at all, and we can just squash enemies. Um, I'm gonna get that button in a second. I wanna do this first. I wanna go through here. Now, if you go over to this caveman and roar at him as the baby T-Rex, he would just laugh at you. But uh, as the dad... <laughs> That's scary. We must go change loincloth. 
Alright, so that opens up that area. And you, you may recall the uh, honeycomb piece that was over in that little, uh, in this little thingy. We could have gotten this at, gotten that as the T-Rex, as the daddy T-Rex. Alright, so yeah, the only two things that you need to T the giant T-Rex for is uh, scaring that caveman and uh, this giant T-Rex button. Now once we press this, we're on a time limit. So boom, that opens up the gate to revealing the blue Jinjo, and we're on the 35 second time limit, so we ought to hurry up and get back inside Wombus Woodwom. jump in her pool. Now we can get out of here. And so it's not it's not gonna take that long at all. I think there was that one point that I took way too long for some reason and uh, didn't make it in time. But uh, that's our fifth blue Jinjo of seven. And uh, now, um, let's actually go just take a look inside that uh, cave that uh, caveman was that caveman was hiding. I mean, was not hiding, locking. Ah, no, that's not good. Oh, that's not even. That's the opposite of good. Get me out of here, get me out of here, get me out of this... Whatever goopy substance that is. Mm. Alright. Let's go inside here. The Oodle Boodles Cave. Hello. You should see someone about that stammer. N no, stammer. Freezing cold. Cave. Uh, no central eating. No food. Either. Hunger. Wonder. Tribe got gold outside cave. Please warm cave up and give food. Here, God, Jiggy. But maybe warm and food. Alright, well, uh, we can't give him food just yet, but we can give him fire. Actually, why did I have to use the, the fire egg? I have the dragon just a Be warm, but still need food. Junk food good. Ah, he's eating the sticks. Ew. Alright, there's another Oodle Boodle right here. Let me cold and hungry, please, help. Oh. Maybe me warm, but still need food, junk food good. Alright, and there's one more oodle boodle, and it's... And I have to, uh, destroy this boulder, revealing a shock spring. And grab onto here. And then climb back up here. Ah, jeez, I really can't see anything. Be cold and hungry, please help. Yeah, it's eating dirt. He's eating dirt. That's disgusting. All right, so we can't give them any food yet, but uh, let me go down here. Uh, right here on this sign, it says to Witchy World. So yeah, 
you may recall that we still had some food left over after feeding the kids. Um, but, and so this is how we have to, uh, this is a sneaky way to sneak the food out of Witchy World into Terry Dafty Land, but, uh, we need a certain move or a certain shoe to, uh, get up to that area. Alright, I can't see anything at all. There we go. Alright, so we're done in here for now. We warmed up the Oodle Boodles. We just have to feed them. Alright, let me go up here. And we have an un I'm pretty sure an underbunga? You seem okay. Me let you in. Alright, so this is just another shortcut like area. This leads back where we uh, got the relic. As you can see right here. Alright, so, we opened up that area. There's also some screen shoes right there, we're not gonna use those just yet. Um, what? Actually, no, 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 let me go to this one area and then I'll do just that. I still need, wait, there's some eggs over there. I could get, well, the unfortunate thing about uh, Clockwork Kazooie eggs is you only get one. Boom. And, uh, just so happens there is a, uh, rock nut dude. Right here. Through this. You gotta go through this little hole. And then. Right here. Nice view. Not. Oh, go shape of pair, but still one of us left. And we know where that last one is, but uh, again, we need uh, a clock worth kazooie aid. And uh, those, those eggs don't grow on trees, and not a lot of chickens can lay multiple of those eggs. I don't even know if they could even lay clock worth kazooie eggs. I would have to... The chicken would have to be a robot for that. And no, I'm not talking about the show, Robot Chicken. Ah, there's the other music notes. Might as well go down here and get them while avoiding this electric eel that's about to shock us. How shocking is that? I honestly need to shut up with these. I mean, I honestly need to stop it with these puns. Alright. There we go. Got that taken care of. Uh. Yeah, we need to be right here. Alright. There we go. Split pad right here, and we just need banjo for this. Now, the unfortunate thing is, we can't attack any of these guys, so. So we have to time that perfectly. Alright. Alright, cool. Perfect. No chisel remains space in your pack. If a way to fill it is what you lack. Pick large things up off the ground and they go and carry them around. 
That'll be all. Trash merched. Now, I believe. Ooh. All right. Yeah, it's it's the Z trigger and the left arrow button on Nintendo 64 controller. I. All right, there we go. So uh, that's actually going to be used for um, when we have to uh, er, when we have to uh, take that um, that sick dinosaur. Uh, did I come over from? Did I come from this way? Actually, no. I don't think. I think. No, I. I didn't come from this way. Yet. Uh, I think this is where I have to go. Maybe? I think I'm wrong again. I think I'm wrong. No, no. I, I was going the right way. Crap. Ah, what am I doing? What am I doing? Honeycomb right the honeycomb piece right there. Yoink. And now we can just drop down. Yo oh Alright, there we go. Uh alright, let's go this way now. Actually, you know what? Let me actually... Um... Let me call the train over here first. Chuffy is enjoying the attractions of Witchy World. Would you like Chuffy to pick you up? Yes, please. Alright. Since we are bringing the train here, that means that, um... We, uh, brought... Strut, I think it's her name? We brought Strut, Strut back. To her home. I hope I um, won't be too mad at me. Diratosaurus. Thanks for returning my lost child. She'll be cleaning out the arcade for the next month as punishment. Well, I think at the end of the day, she's glad to be back home. Alright, so we're gonna keep the train here, and um, we're actually gonna leave Terry Dathy Land for a little bit. Um, we're gonna head back to the family that uh, Styracotaurus cave again. And, uh, we're gonna take, uh, the, the sick dinosaur. Alright, let's head over to the split pad and split up. I just need Banjo for this. You'd be surprised how, how you'd be surprised at how Banjo can stuff this dinosaur in, her, in his back in his backpack. 
not even that. It's not even that huge. It's just, it's big, but it's not like the size of a Styracosaurus. 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 I hope I'm pronouncing that correctly. All right, so let's take this dinosaur over to the train station. Alright, and then we're inside Chuffy's wagon. Now we deposit the dino right there. And now let's uh, get Kazooie back here. And by doing that, we have these little swap bubble clouds. Where we stand in those. And then swap over to... I, to either whoever you're using. Whoever you weren't using. In this case, I wasn't using Kazooie, so we're now Kazooie. So we're gonna leave Terry Dappy Land for a second, so we can we can uh, take care of the sit down. Can I get on the ladder? Thank you. All right, Iowa Hags, where we have to go. Here we are at Cliff Top. Already gave Mumble the Globo, so. You want Mumble's help again? Yes, well, we need to get help for the first time here. I mean, all we did was we just gave you a Globo, and that was pretty much it. So, yeah. Alright. I'm about to shock you for just trying to charge into me right now. All right. Hope this works. Heal, sick, styracosaurus. Dinosaurus is now all, all healed up and much better. So we can now leave. All right. 
right. Sleeve. And head back to Terry Deathy Land. Thank you enough. Please accept this shiny thing I acquired when I trod on one of those Unka Bunkas. We worked really hard for you. Any chance of another, Chidi? No. Fair enough. Alright. So we're done with family business. Now, um, I'll make my way up to the top of this, uh, mountain in the middle. So, let's go this way. Alright, to make our way up here without falling or slipping or whatever. Alright, let's grab these green sheets. Alright, slowly. 